Hello there and welcome to a new job programming video. Today we are gonna be following with the PodJS um, tutorial. So today we are gonna learn how to make calculations and job processing uh, functions with uh, PostJS. So if you remember we had created in the first tutorial this table name it class uh, name it test sorry and we created uh, Sophia with the lat long right so I had created a new table which is basically the same but it has a difference that the column name it is in lowercase and it is because when I was testing the line code I found out that it can have some problems and also it's like a better way to proceed so you can create the same uh, way the table I also added more length to the character just in case you need to add like longer names but basically it's the same formula and for you to know what is this so I created this four point and what I choose and here it's a little bit nerd but yeah you learn some history a part of programming here really quickly uh, this if you know some Roman ancient history uh, there was one of the main imperators which was uh, Trajano who uh, conquered the, the Dacia which is what it is now um, Romania and these are four main points like the place where there was a battle the capital the capital that he created and the capital of the sword of Dacia when they create these provinces for the Roman Empire so what we want to do here is to make calculations with these points that yeah, for example this one it's here okay see and this one is here so they are like quite close and what we want to do is to make calculations how can we make calculations so if you see here we are going to use this st functions from postjs and for example for this one for distance we need geometry one and geometry two so how like which is the way to get geometry here there are different ways but for me the best way or the easy way to understand is that okay we need from here to get the geometry and the geometry is in this table right so if we do you can copy this if we do just this selection everything from Dacia we're gonna get everything but if we change this uh, for location it should return just the geometry so we have the geometry now but we need the, to get the geometry individually so what we can do here is to filter this so you remember here imagine that we gonna get tape so we say that uh, where name is equal to the pi I think that I wrote it and yeah so we have the look the geometry and this geometry we can use it uh, to make calculations so imagine that here we are gonna uh, create a buffer over this geometry okay so we want to create a buffer over this so how we do that we can uh, use the st buffer and we are taking this location and then we can see that it's a buffer of 0 0.1 I think that these are degrees but I'm not 100% sure you, you can just check in the documentation so if we run this we are gonna get a different geometry which is the buffer and again I think that this is the form because of the projection but still I was checking the distance and it, it seems to be working fine so this is how we can get the geometries and the calculations but for example here in ST distance we need two geometries right so how can we get two geometries here so uh, well, I'm gonna remove this first okay so we need two geometries here how we can do that because we need a part of the pay we can get I don't know uh, this one here I don't, I'm not gonna pronounce the name but you got the point 
so okay we want something here that it has name equal this one you can add an and here but if you see this is gonna turn an error because basically we are saying that okay one from this table this like the object the element has to have name tepe and name uh, as so this is not one hour what we need to do and there are many ways to do this but for me the easiest one is that here we can say that okay take this table with the name uh, for example tay for tepe like as tay and then take the same table again but take it with the name uh, s okay for sarimetusa so once we have this we can also came here and say that okay i want the location for t and the location for s i know that this is like a bit weird at the, like if it's the first time that you've seen this but it will make totally sense in a moment so from here what we want is for t we want to filter the pay and for s we want to filter name so if I didn't mistake anything, see, we got both geometries. So now that we have both geometries, we can do the ST calculation. And you can use this uh, method to get all the geometries of the, of the table. Then there are other methods, of course, but this one is one like quite easy to, to use. And here we will get the ST distance what else would we can do so we can also make a line and as we just need these two geometries it will create a line between both uh, okay this happens sometimes i'm not sure why is the reason but sometimes it says that it's not supported but if you create like a new query and you run it it will work so here you you have the the line and now you can apply everything that's related with points but what happens if you wanna for example use estim make polygon and you want to create a polygon from your points so what you can do is to uh, create an array here and i'm gonna copy it i have it over here and i will explain it Okay, so we have the same logic as the main line, but we create an array with the locations and we are taking all the locations that I had added and see, I follow the same logic like T to pay S Sarikusa and then, ah, I copied just too much. Sorry for this. I'm gonna remove everything and just copy it again. Sorry for this. Yes. Ah, okay. So uh, I was just checking which was the problem. Okay, so here, see, we create a polygon from all these points, just creating this array. So with this array, we take all the points and we take the first and the last points are the same. And then uh, we add everything here to the steam make polygon. And if you see, we create with these three points, we create a polygon. And well, there are many options here. Uh, but I didn't want it you to spend a lot of time here so I would just add in the description the different options but you have also ST collect we, and this one is important because sometimes you need to create like multiple points so with ST collect you can create one geometry that has all of them so for example I can show you with Boronoi so if you know the Boronoi polygons and 
again this one is the last one that I'm gonna show you here but you can just uh, check in the description I will add other uh, lines that you can try so if you go to Steve Boronoi polygons it it will use a collection here uh, and if we close it here it should create Boronoi polygons here so here we are so as I said this is super powerful we will see in the next video how we can make also geo process with lines and as I said I will add the lines of code to check other processes for points and also I will add the lines of code in the case that you need or you wanna insert the exact same uh, lines uh, I mean points that I had here so I will add everything in the description bye bye